Hey guys, happy Saturday morning. It's Wild Card Weekend. We're here, at Neighborhood Picks. Um, I'm going to live stream during this, the first game, the Bengals game. Excuse me for my appearance. Like I just woke up. It's not even light outside yet. Um, I want to freestyle over a couple things for today's games because I'm going to do a real live stream during the games. During the live streams, during the live stream today, I'm going to read everyone's um, everybody who entered in the playoff $100 giveaway challenge. So we'll have fun with that. Um, the theme of today, guys, we got serious bad weather. January playoff football. The first game, we got the Raiders at Cincy, at Cincinnati. It's supposed to be 32 degrees high and a good chance of snow before 1 o'clock. That's huge. Uh, the Bengals are 5.5 point favorite. I can literally see either team winning this. And just think about this. E like, either the Raiders or the Bengals are going to not only make the playoffs this year, but win a playoff game. That's amazing to me. So, the five and a half point spread with the Raiders, I'd be really careful with that. If you get a snow game, any team could win. There's no value in the Bengals today. But I got the Bengals in my bracket. I love them. I'm rooting for them today. But there's not a lot of value in them unless you lay the five and a half. Um, they got a couple cool uh, props for that game. Now remember, we got snow. We got cold. Um, Josh Jacobs over under is 59 and a half yards. Joe Mixon, 75 and a half. Those are high. You're not getting value. Longest catch of the game. Here's where I'm betting both. Jamar Chase and T. Higgins, they're known for their yak. They're known for their yards. Um, Chase and Higgins are both at 24 and a half for longest catch. They're both at five and a half catches. No value. Again, they both got to get six. Well, I don't see how they can't, but you could get tricked on that one. Jamar Chase over under 71, Higgins 65. Snow, rain. As much as I love the props, I'm not touching them. I would not touch the props. We're going to talk about that later this afternoon. Closer to game time as we can see what's going on. But um, also, you, there's a couple cool props on different sites. I do DraftKings and FanDuel on, on, uh, fa on DraftKings. They have Darren Waller. Oh, no, this one on FanDuel. Darren Waller and Jamar Chase over under 175 receiving yards. And it's listed at like plus 250. So I think Waller and Chase could go over 175. I mean, Waller's back today. He's there. He's there everything. That's another reason the Raiders are going to be dangerous. Um, what else? Look at the respect. Look at the respect they got on T. Higgins' name. They have uh, position matchups. T. Higgins or Debo Samuel this weekend. Pick them. That's how much respect they have for T. Higgins. Pick him. He's not even an underdog to Debo. Um, I would go with TD scores today. Um, the Patriots game. It's in Buffalo. Same thing. Worse. It could be the, the, the second or third coldest game ever in the history of the Buffalo Bills. If you know anything about Buffalo, New York, it's fucking freezing. Um, they're expecting... The uh, single-digit temperatures today. That's that's colder than that crazy game where Belichick ran the ball 800 times. We're gonna see a wacky game. This is gonna fuck up everything. The Patriots are four and a half point dogs. The Bills are four and a half point favorite. They're home. They're the favorite. They're the team. I love the Patriots today. I think Belichick is ready for all that shit, and that's what leads me to the two backs, Harris. 58, 59 yards. Yeah, I like the over probably. Ramon's, well, whatever, Ramondre Stevenson. The running back for the Patriots, the other one. 38 and a half yards. I am going to hammer him over 38 and a half yards. That's my pick of the day. Ramondre Stevenson over 38 and a half yards. You're going to have single digits. You're going to have wind chills making it feel minus 10 to 15 degrees out there. Little stat for Josh Allen. As big as he is, the big bat, the big chooch, you would think that he would play good in the cold since over the last 15 years in 41 quarterbacks, Josh Allen in 15 starts in career 
in his career, 15 starts under freezing temperatures. His completion percentage is 50%. That ranks dead last out of all 41 quarterbacks. His yards per attempt, 6 yards. That ranks 35th. Um, and then his TDs per interception ratio, 6 touchdowns, 7 interceptions. That ranks 36 out of 41 quarterbacks. So if Mac Jones is ready, the Patriots are running, playing defense, the Belichick factor. Forget this latest Buffalo game. I got the I got the two games to go game in my head. So I really I think the weather's gonna help the Patriots here again. I don't see a different thing. If you saw this movie already, don't imagine a different movie. Simplicity of character is the direct result of profound thought. I've had that quote hanging since I'm grade school. I've, I've always liked quotes. Simplicity of character. What did we see when the weather was like this with New England Buffalo? We saw New England run the shit out of the ball and dominate the game. I think we're going to see that again. I like the Bengals today, but not to bet them because the Raiders could win. I love all the props, but I'm staying away from them. Because if we see snow in Buffalo, I'm not going with my boys Higgins and Chase. Even though I think they could both explode for 200 yards each. Um, what I did was I thought it was pretty cool. They had a couple um, most yards for the wild card weekend by position. I spread it a little cheddar on T. Higgins plus 1,700. Jamar Chase plus 1,400. Tyreek Hill plus 2,000. If you check FanDuel and you go by the receivers... The amount of um, who's going to win the weekend in yards. Cooper Cup's the favorite, and he's plus 450. So you're getting good odds with all that stuff. So like and subscribe. Check us out. Um, Wild Card Weekend starts today. First game's at 430, and I'll be live streaming. And I'm probably not going to talk until then. So I have my voice. But um, I'll see you guys for Wild Card Weekend. Picks better be in. I'm going to announce them all on the live stream at 420 or whatever it is. At <laughs> 420. Neighborhood Picks, like and subscribe. See you guys this afternoon. Good luck.